In this video, we're going to take a look at a number of ways in which you can free up space on your computer. A quick and easy way to free up space is to delete temporary files or sometimes referred to as temp files. To delete these files, go to start and search for run or you can use the Windows key plus R for this and type in temp and hit enter. This will bring you to the Windows temp folder, so go ahead and delete everything here. Next, open up the run window again and type percent temp percent and hit enter. This will bring you to temporary files in your profile, so you can also go ahead and delete these files. Information about your most frequently used programs is saved by Windows 10 as prefetch files in the prefetch folder. Deleting these files can save space and help improve performance. Go to Start and Run and type in Prefetch which will bring you to the prefetch folder where you can delete these files. Next, go to Downloads and delete any unwanted files and any old downloads that are no longer required. Windows Update downloads lots of updates and security patches to update your computer, but sometimes these can take up space in the Software Distribution Download folder, so you can delete these after the update and security patches have been applied. Go to the C Drive, Windows, software distribution and download folder to delete these files. Recycle bin. When you delete files from your computer like documents and photos, they don't immediately get deleted. They stay in the recycle bin and continue to take up space on your computer. So go to your recycle bin and delete any unwanted files. To empty the recycle bin, go to Recycle Bin Tools and select Empty Recycle Bin. Windows has a built-in disk cleanup utility called Disk Cleanup, which can help you clear up space by removing various files. To get into Disk Cleanup, right-click on your C drive and go to Properties. Here you'll see the Disk Cleanup option. First we'll run the Cleanup System Files option. This option will appear if it recognizes your computer has system files like previous Windows installations and old drivers that can be cleaned up. Only run the clean up system files option if you're happy you don't need these files. Once that's finished, you can remove various files including temporary internet files, system error memory dump files and Windows updates. Select what you want to delete and select OK. This will go ahead and clean up any unnecessary files on your computer. Windows Store Cache. Resetting your Windows Store Cache can help delete any apps that are stuck or no longer needed and help save space. To reset this, open a command prompt and type wsreset.exe and hit enter. You can also go to the start search and type wsreset.exe which will also run this command. Once the Windows Store Cache has been cleared, this will go ahead and open up the Microsoft Store. So don't forget to leave a like on this video and subscribe for more tutorials.